Hello guys, it's me Drena. Today I'm showing you a video how to cosmetic, uh, how to use cosmetic on yourself to make yourself very cute. And if you like cosplay like me, you will probably look very cute, huh? So in this tutorial, I show you how to make this because I do this stuff daily, and I really love cosplay. And yeah, I really hope you enjoy this video a lot. So let's go. And I'm sorry for the sound quality, but somehow I've forgotten to make the sound very loud while I record the scrap, so I'm using my voice now and I hope it still turns out well. So first you can see how I start this. Blah 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 blah. Yeah, I'm saying I brush my hair and put them all back. Yeah. As you can see, I brush my hair. Then I'm starting my tutorial with RMS makeup, which is very, very expensive. Easily to get, but it's expensive but still natural and no harm for animals. So, very recommend this because if you use one makeup and buy it, you maybe pay about 50 fees. Of dollar, but you're still gonna use this the entire year, so I still recommend this over the other stuff because it's much better to buy a makeup that you can use the entire year than buy what new ones every month, right? So, yeah, that's another thing that's why I use RMS makeup, which is commercial basically, but that's not purposely. And yeah, I just recommend this uncover makeup. So let's continue. Now comes eyeliner. No, first comes the rouge. As you can you see, I'm using this only under my eyes to make sure that it looks cute. Because if you use it on your cheeks in the central, you look very dumb and odd and long faced. But with this, as I use right now, you will look very cute. You will have some dimples or stuff like this sometimes. So yeah, then I cover my face with it a little, but only under the eyes. Then I continue to make sure that it's still blushy and not too long faced, because as I said, many use it on cheeks, but it looks very terrible then. So let's continue. As you can see, I'm still uh, spreading it a little to make it look cuter, and I have dimples, so that's very really useful in my case. So, next, let's see what did I do there. <laughs> yeah, I'm using my box. That's a box full of makeup because I have no life. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. But it's still a box of makeup, so I'm using another rouge right now, which is waterproof. You open it and put it over the other stuff to make it look more apparent, and then you spread this too a little. And I really recommend this one if you go outside because it's waterproof. So if it's rainy, then you can just walk around with it without being scared that it will be off. But anyway, I love rain. <laughs> but in this case, let's just stop this topic because I know many others don't like rain, which is very sad, but yeah. So now you use your little mirror and check how it looks. If you did this, you continue with the next stuff. Use white eyeliner. Oh, is this a black? A uh, black comb first. So use this for cat eyes. First, make it very black to look a little emo, but then you continue. You use that black eyeliner on both eyes, of course.
and now use a little mirror to look how it looks as you can see in this video I did already go very far with my styling but I'm still not done so if you use the cat liner makeup I recommend you a cat liner which is big stand best of because you can just put it on your eyes and make it totally accurate equal to the other side and that's very recommended as you can see here I do this just put a stamp and so it's spiky and so you have your cat eyes As you can see it's making your eyes very big already and I'm not done yet. So now I think now it comes that I use a white eyeliner to make the eyes even bigger. Oh no, first I continue with the black eyeliner to make the eyes even bigger too but differently. You put it under your eyes, lashes and leads to make sure that it looks big and healthy and cute. So, and now you use the next one, white eyeliner, finally, I think. Yeah. Second, I'm searching something as usually. I search every day something. <coughs> oh yeah, I remember what I searched. Searched my brow eyeliner, which is coming next. <coughs> there it is. Oh no, first comes, yeah, that's a brush, little brushing tool to make it even better. Just create your makeup and rouge a little so it looks even bit better and natural. So, can I finally use the eye tool now? I mean, eyebrows. Uh, eyeliner so I fixed this and finally hope I found it yet yeah so yeah when that's done I continue to make sure that my eyes seem bigger because I love big eyes and I'm anime girl so yeah There we go again with the black eyeliner because I'm never pleased enough with my big sides of eyes so I continue and continue. I'm sorry about this. <laughs> I'm just a perfectionistic sometimes. I'm very sorry about this. I know it's annoying but you gotta imagine how annoying it is for myself. Sometimes I spend hours for the script because I'm never pleased with the result so I continue the whole day. But it's very rare. So yeah, let's continue. Can I use that fucking other stuff right now? It's any wrong. There you go. That's for my eyebrows to make sure they look cute too and make the animation. In this case, I should say when I go outside, I make sure that it's perfect, at least perfect for myself looking because perfect doesn't exist. But when I'm at home, I care a little less about it because. Why should I? Uh, people walk around at home without makeup all the time, but I don't and 
So it doesn't need to be that perfect. <coughs> As you can see, I'm already triggered by myself because it's not perfect. <laughs> but I'm staying home, so whatever. Let's continue. If you still don't like it, you can use a milk and <laughs> makeup eraser. Which I do in this case. <coughs> I use this and just make sure that it's very equal, even at home, because it's crazy apparently, but whatever. So yeah, I hope I just leave it like this because I'm wanting to watch how I continue and continue the scrap instead of just wearing a wig. <coughs> Maybe I wear it now. No, first I'm looking for something. To tie my hair as it doesn't work, right? Now this comes another makeup tutorial with my eyebrows. Yeah, it's totally inequal. I wonder when I'm done with this crap. It's gonna take forever, apparently. Alright, that's better now, it's still not perfect. Oh, that's even much better. At least I try to fix the problem. I wonder when I realized that it's the other side that's using the problem, not this side. Maybe I did now, finally. Oh no, not. <sighs> How anyway? Yeah, 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 blah, blah, blah. I'm not sure what I even said. <laughs> I only see that eyebrows and don't like the style of it because it's still not equal. Still need some fixing. Can I finally fix this crap? No. Now I'm gonna tie my hair. So I tied my hair and now I'm gonna get a wig. Cause I'm a cosplayer. There we go. Here I go with my wig. Put it on top, fix it a little. Then I make sure that it looks very good and not stupid. Then I'm using my head pad, put it on top. 
And now as you can see I'm true animation cosplay style with a cute face and all because of this touch rule that I showed you with makeup which I do every day almost. I'm very used to this makeup stuff because I do this since I was a child so yeah. So as you can see my eyes are very big right now just like I wanted. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this and I stop here now and I really hope that helps you a lot in life if you still don't know how to style yourself or stuff. If you want to cosplay or look just cute, then I really recommend you to use the tutorial because as I said, I'm styling myself like this the whole year so I'm sure I know a lot which tricks look very cute, what makes you smaller, what makes you bigger looking. I mean in your face. So yeah, if you use especially rouge under your eyes, not on the cheeks, they will look much cuter. Make sure that you use it under your eyes and not on the cheeks. Alright, as you can see, I put my eyes even bigger right now with this makeup stuff. And yeah, I really hope that will help you guys. I think I stop here now with this video stuff reporting because as you can see I'm just doing the same crap over and over again to make sure the eyes are very big. But now you know a lot and you know how I do this. So yeah, let's stop here and I hope you have, uh, can use this stuff on yourself if you want to and that you can look very cute then too and if that's the same matter now